Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Primark haul. Right, let's go. First item. Oh, cracker. Oh, I've just realised I've got some clips on my top. I have just done my hair, actually, in case you think it looks a bit wet. So, excuse the, like, it's just, don't know what it's doing sort of day-to-day -day my hair. I've put all the Curly Girl products on and it just hasn't got a clue what it's doing. So, anyway, let's forget about that. Let's get down to the bargains I bought from Primark. Right, first one is the headband. Um, as you know from a previous haul I've done for Primark, um, I've got the headband with like the leopard print on it. Well, they've also got other colours, um, black and silky ones, and they've got this colour, which I thought, well, I should have said my daughter Jessica thought, would suit my hair lovely. £2.50 these are. Forget that bit there, but yeah. Does it suit my hair? I don't know, it kind of blends in with it, doesn't it? But yeah, they've got a load of these. All the headbands are all in the rage at the minute. All in fashion, sorry, should I say. Not all in the rage. Oh yeah, that looks good. So yeah, that's a headband, £2.50. Next item is some socks. They're all doing... Oh, my bag has just fell on me. They're all doing... Let me chuck that down there. A load of socks um, for in Primark. But they've all got different colours on the edges of the socks. Now, I don't know about you, but me and my daughter wear Primark socks and the black ones get mixed up because we both wear plain black. So Jessica's decided to do the ones with black and white on the edging and I'm going to have these ones multicoloured on the edging, the rainbow colours. So we don't get our socks mixed up because it is a nightmare. The amount of arguments we have in the morning, you've got my socks on. So yeah, I've got these ones. They look so fashionable. Probably a bit too fashionable for me being 47 years old, but what the heck these are two pound fifty and you get how many do you get seven pairs jesus you get seven pairs for two pound fifty that is such a bargain oh i should have got more next item is this sports bra as you know i'm doing a keep fit and i wanted a sports bra that had a bit more support on it so i thought i'll try this one I will, sh if I'm brave enough to show my skin, I will show what this looks like on camera at the top of the screen. See if it gives enough support. At the back, it's like that, which is nice and trendy. Uh, I got this one in a size large, and this was £5. So hopefully that will look all right i just like the fashion i just like the fashion of it. you know the orange underneath and then the black coming through you could get away with not just being a normal top actually all right now this is the first bra top i actually do not like this uh, it, i've got this in the size large there's the back that looks nice but it doesn't feel like it for a bigger busted woman obviously it doesn't feel like it's supported at all it feels so loose um i've actually lost the seats so i don't even know if i can take this back yet but no i just do not like the feel of it at all so no support and i think this is the other item which is some jeggings as top you know from my previous vlog my size 14 jeggings were just too tight so i've got the size 16 now and i'll show at the top of the screen that these do fit don't know what that was these do fit a lot better these were six pound so yeah i did need this on 16 unfortunately i remember a time i used to be in a size 10. <laughs> yeah these are the size 16. next one is this like a dress top jumper slash thing jumper slash dress I got this one this was 13 pound in the size 16 there's lots of dresses out at the moment in Primark and I got this one because it's still quite cold outside and it's got long sleeves so I thought this one would be perfect for work more than anything if it's not too short I love that it feels nice and warm as well right another item is this dress um I did buy what size did I buy this in I think I bought this in the large and it does feel slightly big so it makes me look a bit bigger I think but it is really comfortable excuse the jeans because I've got jeans on underneath but it's really comfortable really warm and yeah I do like this this is a thumbs up and next one is my bargain which I got in the sale was £13 down to £5 and this is in a size large 
and it's got a v-neck on it and it feels lovely on and it matches my hair quite good actually but yeah that's my other one right next item is the sleeve is you know i hate it when you're going to show a video and your sleeves rolled inside the top anyway is this mesh jumper now you could put this over vest tops or um bodycon dresses which is what i've got it to do it's to put over a bodycon dress or to wear with a bodycon skirt which i will be showing you on the top of the screen you can get these from primark um, in khaki and cream and black i do want to get a khaki one as well but these are i got this one in an extra large i did try a size large on and it did feel fine but i thought because i'm a bit bigger a bit curvier um i wanted just a little bit more baggy to go over my bodycon dress so i've got the extra large in this but there's not much difference in the extra large and the large if you try it on in primark then this was 10 pound which I suppose it seems a bit expensive, but it does feel a look really lovely on. Next one is the bodycon skirt, which I will also show you at the top of the screen. I got this one in a size 16, which felt perfect, and this is six pound. It's a bit difficult to show you, but it's quite long. It goes right down to the floor, and I'm five foot two. And it's got, if I can find it, <laughs> It's got a slit in the side of it, on the right side of the leg, which goes from about your knee downwards, um, for someone that's five foot two. Uh, elasticated waist. I thought it was really good for six pound. I can't remember that it do any other colours. I think so far all I've seen is black. But correct me if I'm wrong, I might be going back again and having a look. But this does feel so comfortable on, it really, really does. And it looks lovely with it, that jumper I bought. So that's that one, six pound I think is really good. And then, well I need this for work, I wanted to get another, I call them bum bags. Some people call them the American version, which I'm not going to sound here because I don't like the word. But because with F and it's a something pack. I call them bum bags, I used to always call them bum bags from when I was little, so I'm going to stick with calling them bum bags. Put in the comments, if you still call them bum bags, don't put the other word, but just put yes or no yes for yes i call it bum bag and this was six pound which i didn't think was too bad i did want to get a glittery one but i think it looked a bit too stupid at work with the glittery one but yeah it's quite flimsy as well i even used one of these for walking the dog actually perfect to put your phone in and poo bags and disinfectant hand sanitizer perfect good tip there and then the good old wet wipes face wipes these are the gentle facing <laughs> gentle Gentle facial cleansing wipes for sensitive skin. These are the ones that are just perfect for my skin. I've got combination skin. Um, these ones seem to work. I did try the micellar ones. Um, they didn't react with my skin very well. Uh, they made it quite oily. And even though I have the micellar water, but the wipes were no good. They didn't take your makeup off very well either. Um, I've had the cucumber ones, but the smell just makes me feel bad after a while. So I've stuck with my original ones, which are these from Primark for a pound for two. Then the next ones, I will show you Jessica at the top here because obviously it won't be my curvy style of clothing. But my daughter Jessica, who's routine, got this t shirt, um, Rick and Morty. This one, she's already, this is an extra small, this is in. She's already took the tag off, so just bear with me, Rick and Morty. Can't find it. Oh, there it is. The Rick and Morty top was £6 for that. Jessica loves that. She's, she's walked quite a lot since we've got it on Saturday. So, no, not Saturday, since we got it on Thursday. And it's now Tuesday. Yes. So she's wore it for a good four or five days. And next item in the Jessica range is she wanted some more jeans, high-waisted, skinny-fit jeans like the black ones that I've shown in my other vlog. Um, you got these in a size 10 because uh, we did struggle for some sizes and these were £10 so she got them exactly the same size as the black ones but she says these blue ones do feel a bit baggy on um, so it's worth trying the jeans on really in Primark I think I got this because it was in the sale it is my favourite which is the Snow White mugs um, this was £6 down to £3 
Jessica says she was going to be having that one, which says Friday afternoon, and that one's Monday morning. I like that one because I did. I seem to like the bad witches out of all these things. I love Maleficent. So when obviously I seen this bad witch on Snow White, I thought, oh, I'm going to have that one. So yeah, bargain. Half price that was. Two princess ceramic, ceramic mugs. Two princesses. She's not a princess, that woman. Or what? No. And next is the iPhone covers. And Primark. That one was 50p in Primark. This was £2 down to 50p. I've got that for my phone. I'm forever changing my phone covers. I don't know about you, but I'm constantly changing them. So I've got that one. Jessica has also got a black checked one. But it's on her phone at the minute and she's at school, so can't show you. Next item is these two notepads, which are so cute. There's three different designs you can get in Primark. These were £1.50 each. And I just thought they were just so cute with the googly eyes. Me and Jessica, have, I think she's picked that one up at that one. I can't remember. But I just thought they were just so lovely. Little notepads. Is this which Jessica has already wore with a Rick and Morty top is this crop hoodie it says NYC on it you've got the hood on it these will all be shown at the top of the screen this was £8 this was £8 and it's a beautiful orange colour as you can see it matches the hair <laughs> but yeah got this one as well so Oh, do you know I've got cat ears everywhere I've just changed in halfway in between this video I've changed my bed well actually Jessica has helped and she's like, basically changed the bed because of my back problems but I'll show you and I've now got the pug bed in but all here it's cat ears I've always got cat ears I don't like the cats on my bed I forgot when I bought a white quilt set I'm gonna have a cat on it. Enough of that moaning. That is the end of my video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you very soon for my next video. Bye!